Hello, hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. So today is a faceless video, but we are talking about a switching power supply, which I have ordered a couple of weeks back. But the main thing about it, it's, it's a 12 volt, 150 watt power supply. It is capable to output 12 amps. I won't test in this video the amps maximum, but the issue with that power supply is that there is no documentation. And we will talk about the wiring, how to wire this kind of power supply. So this kind of switching power supply, it's, it's pretty powerful and it has a passive heating or passive cooling uh, part, which is, which is nice. But the problem with that is the terminals. So with the documentation, you are not able to understand which wire connects to where. And it, I kind of spent a, a decent time to, to research until I noticed this part. So <laughs> it was not really obvious for the first time that there is, a, there is the line, there is the... which terminal is which. So how to wire? So basically at this point it is entering your current, your AC current. This is the grounding, theoretically, and this is your output. And you have a small adjustment with a potentiometer here and you can adjust that switching power supply. So let's wire it. So theoretically we have two positions, line and wire uh, and by the way this is not the safest thing to do to use like just like that without any uh, ferrulers or any kind of soldering in the end because it can create a short circuit just to be sh make sure that you are using properly these wires and they, it is not creating any kind of soft sh short circuit and use an isolated Phillips screwdriver to to install it. So basically one end comes to one position. This will be the line and this would be the null or neutral. In my case, which is really unfortunate, I don't have any grounding. Do not ever use without grounding. So since it is a demonstration, I can or I will use it without grounding for a very short amount of time. And then for a consumer, I will use a few meter long LED band. And if we check again, so this is the minus and this is the plus. So accordingly to that, my minus is the black wire and the my plus voltage is the red one and let's see so we leave some space that was the grounding this is the minus wire and that is the plus so if i did everything properly let's close this huge safety protection you won't be able to touch at all over there but it's it's kind of a safety and if we plug in in a magic cube which is using 230 volts in in our country and 50 hertz then magic happens so yeah this is working so i will leave a schematic here how is that that working a schematic like in high level this is ac entrance I, again do not touch ever this kind of fires and when it is it's under current this is a switching power supply and that's the consumer which is an led uh, brand and if i make a touch so this is not under current, but if you would have a grounding, then then uh, your casing would be making sure that uh, it's not giving any current to you. So yeah, that was my video about this power supply. Don't forget to hit the like, 
smash the like and subscribe to my channel. Your subscribe is very valuable for me. Thank you very much. I wish you a nice day.